What's going on everybody on YouTube, man? Today we're going to be taking a nice look at the Air Jordan 12 Field Purples. But real quick before we jump into today's video, let me know if you grabbed them. Let me know if you passed. I need to see all you guys' thoughts and opinions flowing down below in the comment section right now, man. Again, man, thanks for tapping into today's video. It's greatly, greatly appreciated. I really wasn't going to drop this video because I kind of sensed the energy, sensed the, you know what I'm saying, uh, the, the want for these extra 12s. But after I kind of did a little bit of research, I've seen a couple of videos and some pictures. I said, bro, I'm gonna give them a shot. And that shot is gonna be me throwing them on the feet. So I'm gonna leave you guys as a final judge as far as are these worth the $200 retail tag, man. So if you guys are new to the channel right now, what I need you to do, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell as well. So you don't miss out on any constant that we do drop, shock drop, exclusive access, all that good stuff we got you covered over here. And we've been showing you guys a pair of 12s that's probably gonna be sitting for a couple of months, man. And please follow it up with a huge like on today's video. You guys know the likes go a long, long way. It shows YouTube you guys are enjoying the content and it pushes out to everybody else so they can join the Vintage Squad, man. Now, I know you guys see the T on me right now, the Outrank Racing T right here is super, super dope. Let me give you guys some, you know what I'm saying, some B-roll of this as well. Goes perfect. I'm talking about perfect with these Air Jordan 12 feel purples. It's not a bad colorway, like I said, and you want the perfect apparel to go with it, go check out Outrank. Uh, use my discount code DaVinci to save you 10% off. They always got you covered every single drop as far as apparel matching with the sneakers. And they too matchy matchy. You still have a nice little variety of ways you can rock whatever sneaker it is with the apparel Outrank has to offer. And before we hop into the sneakers, I'm gonna set them down to the side real quick, real quick, hold on real quick because i want to check out the box this is the first pair of tools that i copped in a minute like i don't even remember the last pair of 12s i picked up that's how long it's been since i had a pair of 12 so it's actually pretty cool to actually you know grab these just to check them out i'm not too for sure if i'm gonna keep them just to be honest with you guys but i did want to give them a fair shot on feet you know what i'm saying so let's go ahead and check it out air Jordan 12 red show black field purple and of course i got these joints in a size now you see it got that nice air Jordan 12 box with the tissue paper inside nothing else nothing fancy you feel me so i'm gonna throw that to the side and finally get to these Air Jordan 12 feel purples, man. So I did a little bit of research. Like I watched a couple videos, like I said, seen some pictures. I seen some notable NBA players actually wearing these things right here. And the person that had the exact, you know, not the exact, but you know, pretty much the sneaker that we have today is Gary Payton when he played for the Lakers. And I also seen Mike Bibby Lowe's uh, with his name written in the side. And I also seen uh, Kenyon Martin. Is it Kevin Martin or Kenyon Martin? I forget uh, if it was the daddy or the, or the son. I keep forgetting. But it is a couple of notable NBA players that did have a pair of purple and black Air Jordan 12s. You know what I'm saying? It goes with the Lakers colorways. And it also goes with the Sacramento Kings uh, uniform as well when you rock in a pair of purple and black 12s, man. You guys already know they go crazy with the material for the Air Jordan 12, nice tumble leather all the way around the sneaker, even including the mud guard right here you guys see on the outsole of the sneaker and on the inner of these joints as well, man. Something also would have been pretty cool with these 12s is they would have threw a little gold strip right here where you see a jump man at. But you did get gold hits on the lacing system. You guys see you got two jump man little accents up there, along with on the inner of these joints as well. And then flipping them to the back heel of the sneakers, man, quality inspired by the greatest player ever. You got hits of black, you got hits of gold, and of course, you got those hits of purple. Black two, three down below, and then leading down to the outsoles, you guys can see, got a nice little pattern that, you know, we always love to see that carbon fiber plate, you got yellow and black down there, yellow and purple. No, it's yellow and black, but you got a predominantly black outso for these guys right here you guys know the 12 is infamous for a little small jump man on the tongue with the two three going down as well so just looking at them like i said it's not a bad sneaker it's just not a sneaker that i honestly need and to end the collection uh if you're a huge mike baby fan if you're a huge you know uh gary payton fan i can see why you go out and grab these things or even the lakers or sacramento kings you know what i'm saying so these go perfect with those uniforms depending on which jersey you do get but definitely the new sacramento kings jerseys that they unveiled last year these joints will go perfect with them joints we might see nba player uh rocking these things next year for sacramento kings we shall see uh but like i said not a half bad sneaker just something i probably will see why a lot of people are not grabbing them if that makes sense i ain't trying to trash a sneaker i really don't say a lot of sneakers are bad because i remember back in the day ice cop everything but now 
200 plus pairs later, I really don't need everything that Jordan is dropping, if that makes sense. So again, please let me know down below in the comment section if you did snag a pair, you pass on a pair. Uh, they probably will be in a Nike out net near you. I'm gonna go ahead and check sneakers because uh, I'd actually go in here and see, you know, what, what the price was in for, uh, seeing how many pairs sold out essentially. And uh, pretty much every single size except for size 16 is currently available for these Air Jordan 12 filled purples, man. And some we do pretty much every single drop. We check the resale value. I know nobody gonna be reselling these, uh, but, but a fair price for these joints is like $180, $185, which is about $20 under retail. You guys already know, gotta add the shipping fees and taxes. He's probably gonna be paying $220. So you might as well buy them on Nike sneakers or wait for them to hit the Nike outlet because it's no rush to copying these bad boys right now. You're gonna see these in the stores for a couple months. So yeah, that pretty much wraps up today's video. Again, make sure you guys go check out Outrank brand. Got some dope gear to go with them. I know some people out there that is crazy for these 12s right here, crazy for 12s in general. I know it's one dude in the comments I did for, what, which 12s, I forget which 12s, but he said all he collects is Air Jordan 12s and I know whoever that was, hey, you probably didn't cop a pair of these field purple joints. So let me know down below. Subscribe right now to the channel. Hit the notification bell for your boy. And please give it a huge like. So you probably jump right into the own feed over these. But again, like I said, check out Outrank. I'm gonna go ahead and link them down below. Use my discount code DaVinci's to save you 10% off. And uh, with all that being said, let's go ahead and throw these bad boys on feet, man. Let's get right to it, bro.